Hey guys, how's it going? It's Matt from Fidelity Gaming TV, and we have some very cool news from the MLB The Show community for you guys today, and uh, you're definitely going to want to hear this. I know I've been waiting for some stuff that uh, they released, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Uh, first off, obviously, MLB 14 The Show is a work in progress, and uh, you know, as we get closer and closer to the release, uh, we want to know th some things, um, including the release date itself, and what they've done is they've basically um, sent us a couple of new uh, updates one of them being uh, the platforms now the platforms are very important everyone's kinda wondering which ones they're gonna be on and they have officially named three different platforms that MLB 14 the show will be um, accessible on the PlayStation Vita the PlayStation 3 and the new PlayStation 4 so yes people with the PlayStation 3 not able to get the PlayStation 4 will be able to get MLB 14 to show. I had a feeling this would be the case, obviously, um, when older MLB versions uh, like MLB uh, 10 the show, you could get that on the PS2, I believe, and the PS3, so I had a feeling that it would be on the PS3 as well, but now that they've confirmed it, that's just uh, a good thing. Um, also, you know that uh, they're coming out with some new things graphic-wise, taking advantage of the new PS4 uh, graphics system, but on the PS3 because it does not have that graphic system PS3 users will not be able to experience uh, the new graphics like the PS4 users will be so kind of a little bit of a downside there but nothing they could do about it it's the PS3 that's why they have the PS4 so um, you know you're gonna see the pictures through you know as we roll through here uh, of the new things some players and you can see the, the just the, the littlest things like the facial hair is so like accurate it's so real life looking it's it's amazing what they've done um, I'm not sure if they're gonna be able to make it at least a little better on the PlayStation 3 um, because you know the old versions of MLB uh, the show like MLB 13 the show uh, was you know you could kind of tell that the players weren't really designed um, as, like the facial hair was kinda like a plastic clay mold it wasn't like a actual each individual hair you know so I don't know if they're gonna make that better um, but I don't think it's gonna, it's not going to be that much better if it is, um, so that's uh, one thing. The other thing, the biggest thing, is the release dates. They have officially announced the release dates. Now, this part right here is a little concerning for me. Um, they have released the release dates. Basically, the PlayStation Vita and the PlayStation 3 will be released on April 1st. Now, first off, usually we're used to getting this game a little earlier, um, I think. I don't know, I want to say like a month before the season starts. I think around March is when we get it. So that's uh, kind of a little bit of a uh, concern there that it's coming out a little later. But that's just the PlayStation 3 and the PlayStation Vita. The PlayStation 4, however, has not gotten a like an official release date. All they're saying is that it's going to be May 2014, which is extremely concerning because I was planning on getting this game on the PlayStation 4, and I wanted to get it, you know, in March. And okay, maybe if I had to wait till April, that's fine uh, with PlayStation 3 and PlayStation Vita. But no, PS4 users will have to wait up to almost two months more if it's late April or sorry, late May. Uh, that's huge. So um, it could be anywhere from a month to two months more. And that's kind of weird because I like playing games right when the season's about to start or right when it just started. You know, not two months into the season. That's just kind of weird. So kind of a little bit concerned. Um, like I said, it could be anywhere from one month to two months, depending on how long they take. Of course, they'll probably release that date soon, but uh, at least we got some dates. Um, now, I think what I'm probably going to do is get the PS3 version um, and just you know play around with it, because what they've said is that you can now access your players from MLB 13 The Show and games before that on MLB 14 The Show, so that's good, so you're not wasting all that time on you know MLB 13 The Show only to start over in MLB 14 the show now you can actually transfer over your characters or franchise to the next MLB and uh, also there they uh, released a statement saying that you will also be able to really um, transfer your players and franchises not only from game to game but from platform to platform meaning if I wanted to buy the PlayStation 3 version of MLB 14 the show 
start a franchise, start a player, do all that, then I could actually go and, which this is probably what I'm going to do, I'm going to go and once MLB 14 The Show comes out on the PS4, I'm going to go ahead and get that, transfer over my player and franchise now that you can transfer it over from different consoles, transfer everything from the PS3 to the PS4, and then probably end up selling the PS3 versions. So uh, thankfully we can do that, um, but you know, not, always, not everyone has both PS3 and PS4, so um, I'm probably going to try to get it um, on April 1st for the PS3 if I can, um, and then eventually transfer it on the PS4 once it comes out there and sell the PS3 um, copy, but you know, uh, at least we got some release dates, that's a huge sigh of relief. Um, but yeah, it's getting closer and closer to MLB uh, season and MLB 14 the show. It's going to get really exciting. I like what I see. I like what I see with the you know the new graphics system. They're using that to their advantage, getting the players to look more realistic and the stadiums as well. So um, yeah, pretty excited, guys. I hope you are too. Uh, this was just a quick little information video. We got the dates. We got the consoles. It's all set in stone now, uh, I guess, except for the PS4 date. But uh, we know it's going to be sometime in May, hopefully early May. But until then, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this little information video. If you did, leave a like. It really helps us out. And also, make sure you check out our channel, check out all our other videos. And, of course, make sure to subscribe. See you guys later. Peace.